Natalie is agoraphobic and acrophobic, both anxiety disorders. The former involves the fear of places or situations that may cause panic. The latter, a pathological fear of heights. To treat her, doctors at the Van Gogh Hospital in Charlois, Belgium, are using virtual reality to help her control her fears. The individual who takes on a virtual reality test knows they're in a safe environment, but the brain reacts as if it were real. And it's here that the shift occurs that helps people get better after exercise therapy. Originally, the virtual reality found a key diversion in video games. That's how we were able to use sets for acrophobia or fear of heights or for post-traumatic stress disorder. There are many different kinds of phobias. Ideally, each program would be customized in accordance with the patient's needs. In Switzerland, researchers are working on an alternative reality machine that could offer a more specific experience. For our virtual reality machine, we started from the idea that instead of creating a 3D image content, we'd rather film it. With this kind of camera, we're able to film a panoramic sequence with sound and enjoy a real experience through virtual reality. These devices are growing ever more popular in the treatment of phobias. However, researchers still have much work ahead of them if they're to conquer these complex anxiety disorders.